Not bad. Yeah. are my age you've probably seen this movie but what you might not know is that this train trestle right here is actually a great fishing spot down on those little piers or whatever they're called is some really good crappie fishing i didn't realize when i was fishing this that this was the bridge from stand by me until about halfway through when i looked at google maps and it said stand by me bridge It was quite windy when I was fishing. Um, made boat control, boat positioning, um, you know, a little bit of extra work. And it also made for quite a bit of wind noise. So for that, I apologize, guys. But um, not much I can do about it. dude back side of this pier they're stacked I could see a couple there's another one I'm catching them right here. Uh, yeah, they're everywhere. Yeah. So it sounded like the other boats were using live bait, worms, um, that type of stuff, which would totally work. Um, red worms would probably work pretty good. Little uh, grubs, mule worms would work nice pretty one. good. And uh, what I was using though that seemed to work really, really well was a little gets it. And these little crappie tube jigs or whatever they called, uh, they just work great. Um, caught a ton of fish on them. I did end up uh, using two during the period of time that I was fishing. 
but caught a ton of fish. And I think it was probably a little bit more productive than, you know, from what I could tell watching the other boats, um, a little bit more productive than um, using the, the worms or whatever. Um, you could float these underneath a, uh, a bobber. That would work too. Uh, lots of different ways you can fish them. I was just jigging them, just tapping, tapping, tapping. I've caught several. How deep are you going? Uh, they're not that deep. You can see them if you look over to this. Like here, do you see my rod tip? Right here? I don't see your rod tip. Do you see that? You see it? Right down there, there's a whole bunch of them. Right down there. Well guys, that's it. This was a really cool, fun spot to fish. Um, it was kind of cooler knowing that it was, uh, you know, a scene from a movie, if that means anything to you. Some of those old movies like that, uh, it's kind of cool to go to some of those locations they filmed at. I've been to the Goonies house up in Astoria, Oregon. Now I've been to the Stand By Me bridge. It really helped that uh, the fishing was good. And the fishing was really good. Um, if you guys have any questions or comments, hit me up in the comment section down below. Thank you guys for watching, and thanks for getting out west with Chris.